you want to play your old school games on your mobile f devices, stick around. I'll show you how to do that. It's my What's going on guys? My name is Wanted. In this episode, we're going to be talking about how to play Nintendo games, Sega games, Super Nintendo games on your mobile devices, your tablets, or your phones. If this is your first time on the channel and you are a hardcore mobile gamer, consider subscribing and turn your bell notification on. Okay, so let's jump right in to the episode. Okay, so first things first is we need to install a emulator. So the emulator is a um, is a software pretty much that lets you um, play uh, your uh, games. Okay, and then um, and then after that, the second part of the episode, I'm going to be showing you how to download those games and then insert them into your phone and then pretty much play them all right so <clears throat> there's a lot of emulators for uh nintendo super nintendo and sega well i figured out there is an emulator that you can download that pretty much um plays all of those games system games under one emulator that emulator is called Classic Boy. Um, so go ahead, download it, install it. I already downloaded it, as you can see. And after you download it, we're going to open it. So Classic Emulator, Classic Boy, sorry, not emulator, but Classic Boy is pretty much one of the best Android emulator that I came across. Okay. So you can tell you can play Nintendo 64, PlayStation 1, uh, Game Boy Advance, Color, Nintendo, Sega, Neo Geo. So, but yeah, this emulator is far the best emulator that I've actually messed with and um, played around with. So get that downloaded, install it, open it. Um, so the second part is downloading your ROMs. So when you down your, download um, your ROMs, I'll have a um, I'll have a link in the description below that will give. Uh, it's pretty much the best website I go to to um, download ROMs. Um, go there, download it to your computer, and then after you download the ROM your computer then plug your plug your phone into your uh, computer uh, by the USB cord and then once you do that I will show um, when you do that then you're gonna open um, file explorer and you're gonna go to your phone then it will have classic boy um, folder go into there choose so when you download it download your roms if it's a nes rom nintendo 64 rams go to that folder and then put the rom into the roms folder there you go so i have mario brothers rom in that folder then after that <clears throat> close it Okay, so you're going to relaunch your Classic Boy once you get back onto your phone or your tablet. Um, then go to the system that you downloaded your ROM to. So mine would be the Nintendo. Open that. So then what you do is down here where it says Game Selection, you'll go to Select a Game. Then here you're gonna have the list of ROMs. It'll pretty much have all the ROMs that you downloaded. Me, I have one one ROM, Super Mario. You'll click it, okay? Then you'll scroll up where it says resume. It'll say new game. So it'll say new game. You'll start your game, 
and then um, uh, it'll open. Okay, so um, so some feature uh, features like um, if you see a let me show you, if you if you see a uh, red lock, it'll mean it's you can unlock that if you pay the uh, full version of the game. I think it's like two ninety nine. So um, you can't resume it. So you can do new game or select a different game. Okay. Down here where it says recent games, it'll have what recent game you played. You can turn your cheats on. Okay, you guys can play around with that. I'm not a so anyway, so you go new game, launch the game, and there you go. Um Cool thing about this is it has the directional pad and it has all of the uh, the touch pads, which is really cool. Graphical buttons, A and B, start your select. So you'll you'll hit your select, which is the plus sign. Start. So, um, now there's one thing that I can tell you right now. Uh, my sound is all the way down on my my phone, but yet you can still hear the game, and it's very. Um, it sounds like you're in a stadium. But once you turn your phone up, it sounds normal as you can see here. You can hear the game. Yeah, guys, that is all. That's it. I mean, and of course, I'm. Uh, no, and, and I noticed that you have to really hold down, like really press hard on the A and B buttons. Other than that, I, just, I like it. It's really nice. Um, you can, and then of course you have a menu. Exit, load game, load file, save game, hide overlay. If you hide the overlay, it'll it'll make the direction pad um, disappear. The A, A, B buttons and the start and select. And reset the game. Whatever. So that is it for this episode, guys. Um, if you liked this episode and you thought it was uh, valuable, um, smash that like button. And... Uh, yeah, let's uh, let's try to get 50 likes on this video. Um, thanks so much for viewing, and till next time, want it out.